Hi, everyone. Um, so I've been asked a few times, how do I get the this slide up here, this daily check-in? This is actually a Google slide, um, and it stays up here at the top of my course. So this video is going to show you how to do that. Uh, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm, I'll remove it so that you can see me start from scratch. So here's what the course would look like without that uh, slide at the top. The first thing you want to do is you want to make sure you have made your Google slide. Um, that's that's something you'll have to do before you do this process. I already have mine made, so I'm going to insert it as an update. So you'll go to the update tab on the left hand side. It's the second uh, icon down. And then up here at the top in the post area, um, just under the window, you have a the third one over is our resource button. You'll click on that. And what we want to do in our resource area is to click on the left hand side, um, our apps button. That first resource that comes up is our Google Drive and that's where we're going to be pulling the Google slide from. I'm going to type in the name of it. It's the daily check in. You know, click the box and I'm going to click import embed. Now there's a weird glitch in Schoology where sometimes import embed doesn't show up right away. And I'm going to show you how to overcome that glitch in case it's not here. I, because I've been using it today, the import embed is here, but I'll show you how to get that to appear. So here's our workaround in case that's not there. You have to go to materials. In the materials, you're going to um, open the drop down choices and you're going to go down and click add a page and once this opens you don't have to put a title in what you're going to do is up here where it says insert content you'll open that and you'll go to your google drive resource app choice and once this opens up i'll type in the same the daily check-in slide and it's right here I'll click that and then I'm gonna do the import and you can see import embed you don't even have to click it for some reason as long as you open it up or just open this pull down menu um, and make sure import embed is here it'll work the next time you go in to do your updates so just close these you don't even have to insert anything so we'll go back to the updates and here's our post. We're going to go open the resource at the bottom of our post window. We're going to our apps button on the left. Google Drive will open up for us and then we'll type in the name of the slideshow or the, the single slide. You can do a whole slideshow if you want to or just a single slide. So my daily check-in slide is here. That's the one I want. Now, when you do the import, you should see import embed. And so you'll see your slideshow here. You don't want to hit post yet though. Um, if you just post, it'll end up showing up as an update and then the next update you put in will move this down. The way to keep it at the top is underneath, um, right here next to post, you're going to click this button and there's a little bell. This turns it into an announcement and this is going to cause it to stay at the top of your course um, all the time. So now I'll click post. So now that it's posted up here, my buttons are still active for each day um, and then the students can do their daily check-in. Thanks for watching.